Maserati Gran Turismo MC is more than just a car. It's a masterpiece, a high performance at cutting edge. The MC adds adrenaline from the track, the bodywork. I mean, this thing is unbelievable. It's literally sculpted for greater aerodynamic efficiency, twin central exhaust, and a rear diffuser. This bad boy starts at around $150,000. Now, the Gran Turismo MC Straddle represents the summit of masterpieces on the Maserati end, engineering expertise and inherited from its race sibling, the Gran Turismo MC Trofeo, which features and technology developed to win races on circuits all over the world. Now, the Maserati style icon is the most coveted sports car on the road today, regarded as amongst the most beautiful designs of our century. The lines of its seductive interior and the voice of its powerful V8 engine turns every head. And I could attest to that as I drove this bad boy. Now, the Gran Turismo is an expression of unparalleled elegance and performance, luxury, and sport, bringing the track inspired excitement and exclusivity to the road with genuine room for four. Now, settle into this couturing seat, turn the key, and escape. Literally, that's how I felt when I drove this masterpiece. The Gran Turismo expands the driving frontier like no other automobile. <laughs> Now, the aerodynamics that inform the Gran Turismo design have been developed by minimizing the airflow of warts that offer around the same car and the same speed. Radical side skirts exploit aerodynamic principles and bring further drama to the car's profile. The real punctuates of the Gran Turismo's sporting intent and high-tech sole with triangular rear lights that employ the LEDs and a wide aerodynamic diffuser opens out over the lower part of the rear bumper. Now the Gran Turismo's exceptionally comfortable sports seats are upholstered in the finest Italian leather. The contour of the seats and seat backs have been designed to provide occupants torsos and legs with plenty of support, especially during high speed coverings. At the front, the seats are electronically controlled as you saw, and the beautiful interior speaks for itself. Now I'm actually a huge fan of this interior. It was a little bit of outdated, but I mean, overall you are talking about an older model. Um, tons of carbon fiber, very easily accessible, different options right in the center console. It's not what you're gonna find in the latest models, but you know what, whatever. This thing is so amazing. I love the overall interior. I felt so comfortable, honestly. When I was doing this review, I felt at ease driving in this car, even though how sporty it was, how amazing and attractive it was from the outside. I mean, literally every single head was turning. They were looking at the car. They wanted to know. They, a lot of people don't see this car, you know, on the roads, but they don't even know what it looks like on the inside. But it was completely plush with gorgeous, really comfortable leathers, incredible stitching. It was awesome. And I mean, the back seats, this car actually has back seats. You wouldn't even think about knowing that if you didn't know that they actually existed in the back take a look at those seats take a look at that stitching literally room for two okay put your car uh, child's car seat back there and let them enjoy the ride with you it's amazing what they did and i'm really happy they have two comfortable seats in the back all right guys as i mentioned we are back and i am inside the car let me tell you all this carbon fiber i mean this thing feels so sporty it's unbelievable now I haven't really pressed on the pedal like I want to, okay, but um, I'm about to. This thing, this thing, driving this thing makes me really excited because honestly, I feel like this thing, just driving from the, just just watching it drive from the outside, I bet it looks super sporty. I mean, I don't see too many of these on the road. All right, this thing, this thing looks sick. It's a little outdated inside, but overall, the excitement is there. If you're looking for that sports car, make sure to hit the link down below to my guys at Cherry Hill Jaguar. This is one of the things on their lot right now. It's absolutely stunning. God. I mean, the, just the sound. Now, I haven't pressed sport yet, okay? But just the overall sound of what this thing is making from the inside, all right, and you guys got a sample of what it sounded on the outside on that sick, sick exhaust. And this engine is just unbelievable. God, I love driving these machines. It gets me so excited. It's actually really, really comfortable inside. 
all the leather. I mean, this thing is like carbon fiber overkill, and I love it. I mean, look, I, I feel like I'm going 10 miles an hour. The thing in the front is telling me I'm going like 25 miles an hour. Take it a little slow right now. We're in a neighborhood setting, but hopefully I get to really feel what it sounds like and it feels like in just a moment. And I'll let you guys know what I think about the speed. Man. What an awesome car. Now, the buyer for this car could be anybody from a businessman to a family man. I mean, they made this car in mind for individuals who want to put people in the back. All right, there's plenty of room in this sports car. Not too many sports cars have the room that's available in this car. Maserati did an incredible job of actually allowing such a car to have spacious interior access. It's absolutely awesome. Oh man, the, the downshift in this thing does. I can't wait to put this thing in Tetronic and use the uh, and use the paddle shifters because just the overall speed. I mean, um, I'm getting looks left and right in this car right now. People want to know. People want to know what this guy does for a living. That's what they really want to know. I just tell them I'm a, uh, a YouTube celebrity. Um, man, I really like the clocks. Any car that has a cool clock on the inside here, love that. God, I need to take this thing. Go ready, go faster. thing is pretty sensitive to the surrounding area and we're about to get on some roads that we could actually let it loose just a little bit and then we could uh, talk about that a little more in detail I'm really excited to just hit the sports button I really just want to hear that exhaust overall as of right now I mean it is what it is for this I mean this isn't a hypercar but it definitely is a supercar okay and it's got the packaging it's got everything that you would want in here for the right price. I mean, this thing is low on miles, and it sounds like it's brand new off the lot. That's what I love about some of these cars, that they, they hold a nice, tight kind of feel. They don't get too loose and too, you know, when the belts get too loose or just overall the, the engines get too loose, it doesn't give you that that that, that feel, that, that new, fresh feel. But this is keeping that feel, even at 40,000 miles. Freaking awesome. So I, I pushed on I pushed on the gas just a little bit and I mean there's a lot of horsepower behind this thing it feels it feels awesome all right let's give it a little gas It's a lot of fun driving this. A lot of fun. It's like really exciting too. Very cool car. I really like it.
Hey guys, it's Mike here with Unique Mechanics. Thank you so much for watching my videos. I hope you enjoyed this video of the car review. Right here is our subscription button. Make sure you hit it so you can get notifications in your email regarding upcoming and updated and newly posted videos. Again, I want to thank you so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe, share, and I'll see you here in the next one.